Hello, everyone. Welcome to Tian Mo. We teach the rectangular six box grid calligraphy of Yu Shu Ti. I'm the presenter Li Jingying. I had a beginner question before. What is the standard of stroke thickness and inclination? How do I know whether I do well or not? Many years later, my students ask me the same question. In fact, the stroke thickness and inclination are relative to its structure. There are different situations, singles or combinations, one character or in sentence, big or small, be horizontal or vertical. You get different answers. Under the premise of complete layout, keeping the structural balance and knowing the purpose of different thickness and inclination are the way to create ever-changing characters. Of course, practice more is the key to improving judgment, which can enhance self-learning ability. That is a lifelong benefit for yourself. Today's radical is a ear. The organ that enables hearing. The ears are on either side of the head. Based on this feature, we also code handles as er. Related characters are about ears, hearing, or sounds. Let's go practicing. Yu Shu Ti calligraphy tutorial. This character is er ear. It's a single, so we put it in the middle. Make it thicker. Light pressure up. Go to the next row. Oblique joint strokes. We put a radical on the left. Ling, listen. Don't cross the center line. The right part is lean, older. It's all for today. Learning Yushu Ti is easy and interesting. Practice may progress. Next part is one stroke performance given by our master Li Qinghe. Calligraphy master performance. New video at 10 o'clock every Tuesday night. English version will be uploaded every Friday night. Please stay tuned for our updates. See you next time.